In this video, I'll demonstrate a few ways you can use Pixie to monitor your network without any manual instrumentation. Pixie is an open source Kubernetes observability tool for developers. Pixie uses Linux eBBF technology to automatically capture telemetry data such as network and resource metrics, full body requests, and application profiles without the need for any manual instrumentation. Installing Pixie takes less than five minutes using one of the install guides or videos linked below. A global view of the network traffic flowing within a cluster can be used to quickly determine which services are communicating and identify any misconfigured services. It can also be used to identify load balancing issues. Let's use Pixie to see the flow of network traffic within a cluster. I have the live UI open and my cluster is selected in the drop down menu at the top. I'm going to select the script drop down menu and start typing net. I'm going to select the net flow graph. And when the script opens, you'll get an error indicating a value is missing for the namespace required argument. The UI denotes required script arguments with an asterisk after the argument name. Let's look at traffic within the PL namespace. PL is the namespace that Pixie's pods are deployed to. So I'll select the drop down arrow next to the namespace argument, type PL, and hit enter. The NetFlow graph script updates to show a map of all the outgoing connections for the pods in the specified PL namespace. Gray hexagonal icons represent pods making network requests. Blue circles represent remote endpoints. If the request's remote endpoint is within the cluster, then the IP address is resolved to a pod or service name. Hover over an edge for network transmission stats for a particular pod pair. Thicker lines indicate more traffic. The table below the graph shows the same data used to construct the graph. Click on any column title to sort the data. Let's filter the graph to only show communication to the PL NATS pod. Select the drop down arrow next to the two entity filter argument, type PL NATS, and press enter to rerun the script. The graph should update to only show network traffic sent to the PL NATS pod. To clear the two entity filter value, select the drop down menu arrow and press enter. Another capability Pixie provides is the ability to inspect and analyze DNS traffic. This information can be quickly used to determine which services are making DNS requests, get high level DNS latency and throughput information, and observe imbalances in throughput between DNS servers. Let's use Pixie to see a flow of the DNS requests within a cluster. Select the DNS flow graph from the script drop-down menu. The DNS flow graph script shows all of the DNS requests made within the cluster with latency and throughput stats. This cluster doesn't have anything deployed except Pixie, so all we see are the cube DNS pods communicating with the metadata server. To sort the DNS request by average latency, scroll down to the table below, which is the same data that's constructing this graph, and click the latency average column to sort the data. TCP drops and retransmits can indicate network connectivity issues that may affect application performance. Let's use Pixie to see a global view of TCP drops across the cluster. Select TCP drops script from the script drop-down menu. This script is a pixel mutation script. While the previous scripts query the Pixie platform for data, this script extends Pixie to collect new data. Mutation scripts must be run manually. They do not automatically run when they are first open. Press the Run button in the top right, and the script will first deploy a trace point, the new data source, and then query that new data source. Hover over an edge to see the number of drops between pod pairs. The color and thickness of the edges in indicate an increase in the number of TCP drops. After a few seconds have passed, press the Run button once again. Since more time has elapsed since the trace point was deployed, you should see more TCP drops in the graph. This video demonstrated just a few of Pixie's community scripts. For more insight into your network traffic, check out the related scripts section of the network monitoring tutorial linked below.